yeah good evening everyone so welcome back to our class so today in this session we are going to discuss about equivalence division lemma method exclusively this topic is very very important for 10th class mathematics okay so this is a concept from 10th class mathematics unit number 1 that is about the real numbers so in that real numbers the topic name which we are going to discuss right now is about equivalence division lemma method okay so already in the previous video class we have discussed about the introduction how to find the hcf so hcf mana ela find out chestam ani cheppi manaki previous video class discuss cheskonu jarigindi so generally hcf can be found out by using two different ways okay the first way in which we are going to find out the hcf is prime factorization method okay please don't forget so hcf and lcm can be found out by the first important way the first important way is called prime factorization and the second important method is called equivalent division lemma method please don't forget okay so hcf and the manaki rendu vidhalaga kanukochu okay first one technique endante prime factorization so using prime numbers like 2 3 5 7 11 13 17 19 23 23 23 so like that so ivannitni kuda manam prime factorization technique antam so using this prime factorization technique we can find out the hcf and the second technique right now we are discussing about the equivalent division lemma method so already manam cheppun dan entante equivalent division lemma method is nothing but dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder so already in the previous video class we have discussed about the equation which is in the form of a is equal to b q plus r manaki a equation aithe ee formula untundo ante a is equal to b q plus r ఈ ఫార్మేట్ లో ఎక్కడైతే మనకు కనబడుతుందో దట్ ఈక్వేషన్ ఈ సెట్ టు బి ఎక్లూడ్ డివిజన్ లెమ్మ మెథడ్ సో హియర్ ఏ అండ్ బి ఆర్ ఎనీ పాజిటివ్ ఇంటిజర్స్ అండ్ దేర్ ఎగ్జిస్ట్ ఎ యూనిక్ పాజిటివ్ ఇంటిజర్స్ లైక్ క్యూ అండ్ ఆర్ విచ్ సాటిస్ఫైస్ ద ఈక్వేషన్ ఏ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి క్యూ ప్లస్ ఆర్ దట్ కాన్సెప్ట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ ఎక్లూడ్ డివిజన్ లెమ్మ మెథడ్ సో వన్ సెకండ్ ఐఎమ్ సేయింగ్ ఇన్ ఏ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి క్యూ ప్లస్ ఆర్ దేర్ ఎగ్జిస్ట్ ఎ పాజిటివ్ నెంబర్స్ ఏ అండ్ బి సచ్ దట్ there are one more unique pair q and r which satisfies the equation a is equal to b q plus r that equation is said to be equivalent division lemma method equation clear in that one a is called as a dividend the largest number so each of the numbers lo edaithe largest untundo danni manam a kina teesukuntam a ante ikkada endante dividend okay dividend antu em antu ante so here a is called as dividend okay em antu undanu dividend is equal to smallest number a numbers tho ite manam divide cheyabothunnamo aa number ni divisor ante b is nothing but here divisor ఆ డివైజర్ ఎనీ టైమ్స్ చేస్తే డివిడెంట్ క్యాన్సిల్ అవుతుందని చెప్పేది క్వశ్చన్ సో క్యూ ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ క్వశ్చన్ సో క్యూ ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ క్వశ్చన్ ప్లస్ బ్యాలెన్స్ ఎంతైతే మిగులుతుందో దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ యాజ్ ఎ రిమైండర్ సో ఫైనల్లీ యూ క్యాన్ సే దట్ ఏ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి క్యూ ప్లస్ ఆర్ సో హియర్ ఏ ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ డివిడెంట్ బి ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ డివైజర్ అండ్ హౌ మెనీ టైమ్స్ యూఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు క్యాన్సిల్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ క్వశ్చన్ అండ్ ఫైనల్లీ వాట్ ఈస్ లెఫ్ట్ ఓవర్ యూఆర్ కాలింగ్ ఇట్ ఎస్ ఎ రిమైండర్ సో ఏ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు b q plus r so finally you can say that dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder so right now we are going to solve some of the important problems if problem solve just me you will get a clear idea about the equivalent division lemma method so clear so right now we are going to solve some of the important problems so here the what is the question is nothing but please note on the question find the values of q and r so here we need to find out the values of q and r find the values of q comma r so q value r value manu find out cheyal ante from the equation a is equal to bq plus r we need to find out quotient and we need to find out the remainder okay so it means that a and b values they will give you so they will give you a and b values from that a and b values we need to trace out q value and r value so find out the value of q and r for the following pairs of integers a and b okay so a value b value ichestadu and so ichesin tarvata da nunchi manaki we need to find out q value and r value so first of all first equation is nothing but a is equal to please note on the problem a is equal to 13 and b is equal to 3 ila ichadu and chudandi so a is equal to 13 b is equal to 3 by using this a and b by substituting here we need to trace out the q and r values very very easy so for example apply the equation a is equal to 
bq plus r if you apply this equation in the place of a can i write 13 correct or not so 13 is equal to in the place of b can i put here 3 so 13 raval ante 3 ki daggara unna 20 number of times change change 3 1s are 3 3 2s are 6 3 3 is are 9 3 4 is are 12 ante 13 daggara kalthunu kabatti 3 into 4 so 3 into 4 chese ento avutundi 12 avutundi but here 13 is there and a balance ink ento mani milindi a balance ikkada mani rastundi in the place of reminder is it clear or not so finally 13 is equal to 3 into 4 plus 1 so if you compare the terms so a is equal to 13 b and mani ento avutundi 3 avutundi and number of times so q value 4 avutundi and what is left over is the that is called as a reminder one note. So finally here Q is equal to how much here? 4 and finally R value is equal to 1. So this is very very simple method. So by using this equal division lemma method, if they give you A and B values, we need to find out Q and R values. Clear? So shall we go for the next example? So the same question, find the values of Q and R for the given AB values. So right now the AB values are nothing but here. A is equal to 80 and B is equal to 8. So the same equation again we have to apply A B values for each other and again we need to find out Q and R values. So finally we apply the same principle A is equal to B Q plus R apply to C. In the place of A can I substitute 80? Correct or not? 80 is equal in the place of B can I substitute 8? So finally put 8 table to 80 ala 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 so 8 into how many times? 10 times. So 8 times yes and those will be 80 or some property. So remainder will be 0. In beginning they will be later. Now again compare the terms. In the place of A 80. In the place of B 8. In the place of Q 10. In the place of remainder R 0. So finally by using A and B we got Q is equal to 10 with R is equal to 0. So this is second model. Is it clear or not? So we need to find out Q and R by using A and B values. Okay. So shall we go for the next sum? So third sum is about they have given A value, A and B values as A is equal to 125 and B is equal to 5. Very very easiest to summon. Okay. So A is equal to 125, B is equal to 5. And apply the same process. So A is equal to, we know that formula BQ plus R. Okay, in the place of A, again substitute 125 and again in the place of B, we need to substitute how much? 5. So, 5 into, 5 into, 125 kills 5 ones are 5, 5 twos are 10, 5 threes are 15, 5 twenty-five is 125, correct or not? 525 is 125, 125 kabati, 5 into 25 is equal to 125. So finally, the remainder of 1 is equal to 0. So finally, in the place of A, 125. In the place of B, 5. In the place of Q, how many times? 25. And finally, what is left over? Remainder 0. So finally, Q is equal to 25 and R is equal to 0. So finally, in each and every stage, we have obtained the values of Q and R by basing upon the A and B values. Correct or not? So this is a method in which we can calculate quotient and remainder by taking the values of A and B by substituting in the equation of equilibrium division lemma that is A is equal to BQ plus R. Is it clear or not? So the last example, we will try it and we can close it. Then we can, in the next video class, we can concentrate on finding out the HCF using Eclodition Lemma method. Eclodition Lemma method, we have two models. First model is finding out about Q and R values. If you do model number one, you can observe change. So Q and R, Q and R, Q and R. This is the first model. So finding out Q and R is the first model. Second model, by using this Eclude Division Lemma method, we need to find out the HCF. That is second model. It will be discussed in the upcoming video classes. Okay, so one more example, you shall do it and you can conclude that one. Okay, clear. So finally, the last example is about the, again, they have given A and B values. A is equal to 132. A is equal to 132. And B is equal to 11. So, A each other, B each other, and finally we need to find out the values of Q and R. So, finally we substitute this in the play, you know that equation A is equal to BQ plus R. But this is the equation A is equal to BQ plus R. In the place of A, we need to substitute 132 
is equal to in the place of b 11 into 11 ki enni sal chestunna 32 vastundandi so 11 12 chestundi ona kada 11 into 12 cheste so 11 2 is 22 11 1 is 11 so finally 132 so 11 into 12 cheste manaki entho chindi 132 ochindi kabatti inga remainder zero in miglin devi ledhu kabatti correct anadu so finally in the place of b 11 in place of q how many times 12 times the number of times manu question tan cheptunnam okay meer a example teeskunna chudandi number of times enaithe ostunna aa number of times manu question kan teeskuntunnam so finally and find r is equal to zero so finally q is equal to 12 and r is equal to zero so these are the various models in which we can find out q and r by using equilibrium division lemma method again i am saying that equilibrium division lemma method is having two important models the first model is about finding out q and r by basing upon the a and b values by substituting in the equation a is equal to bq plus r that is the first model and second model is in equilibrium division lemma method we need to find out the hcf so that will be discussed in the soon upcoming classes okay good evening have a nice day